Now, after serving for 32 years as a permanent secretary of the Delta State Government House, Mr. Tony Obu finally took a bow with a special Thanksgiving service. Now, we have a lot where all that is coming from, so do me a favor, stick around, we'll be right back. Now we begin with the event taking place right here where dignitaries gathered to celebrate 80 successful years of Pastor Shingo Wigui. Songs of praise come in right from 80-year-old Pastor Shingo Wigui as he marked four scores at the Redeemed Christian Church of God. For a man who takes his Christian faith very seriously, he chooses to start this beautiful day in the presence of God. Pastor Wigwe, the former Director General of the Nigerian Television Authority, NTA, is indeed joyful on this day, attaining this unique age. His wife, children and grandchildren, as well as other eminent personalities, join him to celebrate this unique occasion. A life worthy of emulation, everyone says. A man who has touched so many lives and still ready to touch more at 80. The crowd here says it all. They have all come to identify with him. He stepped up to the podium, sharing a bit of his life experience at 80. I was in the army. How did I get into the army? Because this particular day, I did my wife. I left my wife at home. My wife with a little baby. I'm talking about the year 1962. Yes, the year 1963. I left the bathroom, went to the military, and they gave me a letter from my mate. Brethren, I had left the home as a civilian, but by the time my wife was sitting at the bathroom, you know, I had become a soldier. At 80, Pastor Shingo Wigwe still exudes some strength as he displayed during the Thanksgiving. A word of prayer for the celebrant and his family. Thank you for this cheer that you have given to our daddy. Thank you for everything you are doing in that family. Thank you for the wonderful testimony. Even from the wife, even from the husband, even from the children. Lord, please accept that man said that name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you for the Lord. The Bible tells me that at old age you will be fruitful. He cuts his cake with his family, bringing the service to a close. The event to celebrate this great man did not end here, 
as it continued with the reception, which started right away with a cocktail. All set, they welcomed the celebrant, who was now changed into another outfit with a song from Sami Okoso. Dancing to the beat was just a good way to start the reception where more prominent people joined the celebration. Some special guests here include Forbes richest man Alhaji Aliko Dangote, Chairman of Zenith Bank Mr. Jim Ovia and wife, former MD Bank of Industry Ms. Evelyn Uputu, renowned accountant Bashanu J.K. Randall, amongst other important guests. As they settled down, they went into another round of praise, this time with Lara George. It was indeed a festival of praise, all to celebrate Pastor Wigwe. A duet from Dari at Alade and Wade was just perfect for the celebrant and his wife alone. and from dance till the cutting of his birthday cake. <laughs> Veteran musician Onyeka Owenu was in the house to honor the celebrant with her voice. Mr. Shingo Wigwe was born on the 8th of October 1934 in Ikwere Town, River State. He is a man of many parts, starting off in the army, where he rose to the rank of captain in 1964. After a stint in the army, he ventured into the media and reached the zenith to become the director general of the Nigerian Television Authority NTA, a position he held from 1986 to 1990. Five years later, he completed his theological course to become a pastor at the Redeemed Christian Church of God. He is a husband, father and grandfather.